Hello everyone, Carson here and welcome back to my channel. Now in today's video, I am going to be running you through really quickly how to install WordPress on free website hosting. Now before we do get into this video, I do just have to give you a disclaimer, which is I do not recommend using free hosting or any type of free website service. Those services are usually riddled with security problems, bugs, and horrible uptime, and they're just not worth it. So if you do want an alternative, a very cheap 99 cents a month alternative, go ahead and check out my link in the description where I recommend a hosting platform as an alternative to free hosting. It's super cheap and you get a discount on it, so check that out if you'd like. And now I'm gonna go ahead and run you through really quickly how to install WordPress on free hosting. Now, on a lot of these hosting plans that are actually paid, this process is automated so it's not as complex, which is another reason to go with paid website hosting. However, if you are still convinced that you want to go with free website hosting, let me go ahead and detail that to you right now. Now, all you have to do to in essentially install your WordPress on your free website hosting is you go to your hosting panel, to your C panel, and you scroll down till you find the WordPress installer. It's going to be on the C panel in a little block where it'll show the, either the WordPress icon or a website install icon. It varies depending on the C panel type. However, once you find that, you're gonna go ahead and click that and then follow the process. The process essentially, you just have to input all the information, which of course is usually automatic automated, but you're going to have to do this since you are going with free website hosting. So you'll put in the domain name, the database, all the information, all the required information before your website can go up. You'll put in your password and your username, and then you'll hit install. Once you hit install, it's going to load and it's going to install, and then you're going to be able to go to your website. And if you remember the password or if you wrote it down, you'll be able to go ahead and log into your WordPress website and get started. Now the installs a lot of times on free hosting do not take a short amount of time. They can take anywhere from like 10 minutes to an hour, just depending on the level of hosting you are getting with your free WordPress hosting, which is a lot more obviously of a hassle than with paid hosting. However, if you just stick it through and just wait it out, it will install eventually and then you can get started. That is going to do it for today's video though. That's just a basic, basic information on how to install WordPress on your free hosting plan. Because because a lot of times when you use free hosting, obviously WordPress is the platform of choice. So it's always good to know how to install it through your cPanel on your free hosting plan. Now, if they don't give access to cPanel, this tutorial won't be able to help you, but ideally they should. And if they don't, I wouldn't recommend hosting with them, even if you're going with a free hosting provider. That is going to do it for today's video though. So remember, of course, as I said, to leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. I will have a link in the description to all null alternative to free website hosting a super cheap alternative at a special discount and I will see you in the next video.